Speaking of the Olympics, Australian Olympic boss John Coates believes Australia can finish in the top five nations at next year's London Games, today marking 12 months exactly until the Games begin. A year out and our hockey players couldn't help but get caught up in Olympic fever, weaving their way through London court. The buzz is definitely there. Um, even on Twitter today, there was a whole lot of tweets going around. You can be dominant for, for a couple of years like we have been and, and if you don't get the end goal, which is the Olympic gold medal, uh, no doubt we'll be very disappointed. Punching above our weight has been a historic theme for our Olympians. The hockey roos happy to take the underdog tag. The eras kind of are changing a little bit and with this new young influx of players there really comes a completely different dynamic. Cycling set to lead the charge for medals on the back of Cadell Evans' inspiring victory at the Tour de France. And Amir's won gold at the Athens Games and made a remarkable recovery from injury to claim silver in Beijing. This year around I'm, I'm probably going in as one of the medal contenders, one of the favourites, having had such a, a wonderful preparation and lead-in. Our swimmers are currently at the World Championships in Shanghai and are tracking well for next year, especially with the improvement in our men's team. Athletics is predicting six medals, Steve Hooker, Sally Pearson and Danny Samuels carrying the load. Our triathletes continue to excel, as do our sailors. The expectation of our Aussie athletes to finish in the top five. We will be locked together in a competition with Britain, with France and with Germany, uh, all countries with significantly greater population. Tim Hipsley, 10 News.